up. I know you're not wearing pads yet, but it's good to get back out there. Yeah, I mean, everybody's excited to go out there. Um, right now, we're just working on getting better, getting the techniques right, um, helping the younger guys, and uh, we're excited to play. Get your first practice as a senior. Does it feel a little different now? You know, being one of the, for sure, one of the older guys around now? Yeah, I mean, this is my last go around, so I, I probably should have gave it all. At the beginning, but right now I know I, just, I got to give it off for everybody else. Justin, you mentioned those younger guys. You got a couple of them in, in your room, your position group. Are they getting lost at all today? Yeah, Manuel, Peter, man. I, don't, I don't think they was lost. They was a little bit slower than slower than usual, but um, they picking it up. I mean, they're gonna be ready tomorrow. They'll be ready. Just now that you've had a couple months to go back and I guess you know, really look at film and really study last season and think about it, how, how did it go overall for you? Was it about like you thought? Did you want to do more than you did? How, how would you evaluate last year? Um. Last year was just something that, um, really, I was just I was just out there playing for for everybody else, and um, I'm, I don't really want to think about last year right now. But it's just something like we, I'm looking forward to playing this year. What were the biggest improvements? I guess you wanted to make. I mean, I guess that's why if you go back and look at things in the past, maybe to, to, to look at things that could get better. What are the biggest things you're working on? Well, right the now? first thing I know I'm working on is um, actually making a lot of plays. Like when the interception come, I'm gonna actually have to make it. Um, uh, creating more turnovers and uh, helping the team do a little bit better. How much has it changed the defense to have Kurt back out there now? He obviously was a scout team superstar uh -huh. know, last season, but to have him back out there with the ones. See, Kurt, Kurt is a, he's a big leader. He He's a vocal leader. He's a physical leader. He leads by example. He does everything right. He does everything right. And, um, like, when he's out there, you can feel the energy from him. And he want, if he wants things done, then uh, you got to get it done for him. Justin, it seems like that room uh, with Emmanuel and with Thanks. DeAndre, it seems like there's you know, more guys there at corner than maybe there were even last August when you know, Cam had to come in and, and start right away. Is, can you tell if there's more competition there? You got other guys kind of coming coming for those two spots. I mean, it's always competition. Um, Coach one is he wants the best. He expects the best out of everybody. And um, DeAndre is somebody who can, he's he's very talented. He's agile, and um, you can see that he really wants to play and. Emmanuel too. They they both really want to play. I mean, if they can start at corner, they can start. But um, just something that uh, we're gonna see is a lot of competition out of the corners. Justin, what do you like about the, the nickel? I know you just worked there today. I mean, huh. I know you worked there a little bit last year in practices. But what about that position as a defensive back? Do you like? Well, it's just something like I just feel like playing nickel. I feel like I'm a linebacker. I mean, I just feel a little bit bigger. I am a little bit bigger, but um, I know you can make a lot of plays at nickel. Um, you play a lot on the run, and stop a lot of pests. Is that, I mean, is that a move that you're excited about when they talk about you playing that spot? Is that something you're like? Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm willing I'm willing to play anywhere. They put me in linebacker at 190. I don't know. I play there. Was that a position? That seems a, in the past a lot of position. A lot of guys have talked about that nickel position being one that's fun to play. Is it is it like that in this defense as well? Yeah, it's pretty fun. Everybody relies on nickel, and um, um, what they expect out of us is a lot of plays made. I think that was missing last year at that spot. I know you were a corner, so you probably, I don't know if you were paying much attention to it. But yeah, I definitely was paying attention because I hear it every week. Like, um, they needed help out the nickel, and that's just something I was willing to step up to. If there's three linebackers on the field, do you see yourself sliding to safety or going back out the corner instead of nickel, if there's no need for a nickel? Um, I'm not really sure, but, um, I mean, if they want to put me at safety, I'll play safety. and want to put me at nickel, I'll play nickel. Justin, what's it like to have off season and a spring with the same coach coaching. Um, see, that's that's a good question because I never had that before. Yeah, but but um, I mean, how nice was that today? That the terminology was the same. It was. I mean, I know you're in a new position, but at uh -huh. least all the concepts were the same. It wasn't anything radically different. What, only, what did that feel like? The only thing I I felt that was different was like everybody there knew what the expectations was and the freshmen coming in kind of seen that what we expect like what they expected from us and we we had to show everybody the expectations that's what we we knew what was going on so we play a lot faster and did everything right that help you think that'll help you individually get get better in the off season more than you ever have because you've had that continuity of the oh, yeah. same coaching oh yeah cuz um basically we come together closer as I mean, a complete team, team as players and coaches. We came together, and um, we just we looking forward to playing this year. With so many new faces on the practice field, did you notice a difference in the mood, excitement level of practice? Um, I mean, really, I feel like since our leaders out there, 
it brought a, a different kind of, uh, I guess you could say, swag to the field. Cause um, like Kurt and AJ, they they best buddies, and um, you can kind of feel that on the field. Like they they want things done, and um, I, I'm, we're gonna try our best to play for them. Any of these young guys catch your eye today? Um, really, DeAndre and uh, Emmanuel. They both kind of show that they they really want to play. I seen Emmanuel make a couple plays out there. And um, DeAndre, he got caught in the heat of the moment, but um, like Coach said, welcome to the SEC. What, you shove somebody or something? Uh, no, it's, it's just, you know, practice. It happens, things happen, get beat. 